Open sesame! Or not. I am all out of bread. Well, that got it. I'm going to have to get some bread and stuff. So, what is going on, guys? <laughs> Go here today. We were back at RP Construction uh, Farm Simulator 19, I guess. It's just a little uh, branch off, I guess we have. But uh, today, we. Well, we actually were not really doing a lot of construction. We've got to haul some gravel. We got to haul one load of gravel to my buddy David. Now, he actually lives down the road from us. Check that out. I didn't get hit by a door. But he actually lives down the road from us. Uh, you go out, take a left, go straight, and there he is. Um, but we are going to be borrowing a, a horse trailer from him. So we're going to take him a load of gravel, not dirt, gravel. And I'm going to take the dump truck. I'm not going to... I was going to say we'll take the old Ford, but can't do that. So we're going to let this bad boy fire up right here. She's, she's been sitting for a while. We're going to let it fire up, and I'm going to go get the backhoe. And we're going to load the truck up with some gravel. And then we're going to take it over there, dump it, grab a horse trailer, and we're actually getting some horses for our pen down there. Um, he's actually going to go because he knows where they are and everything. So he's going to, try, he's going to help us out and everything. Open sesame. Or not. Don't really know what went on there, but apparently the door didn't want to. Okay, so I'm gonna have to drop this down. I love how I have to drop it because their air garage isn't really that tall. But then we can just raise it back up and we'll grab some gravel. Now we have more sand than gravel, but that's kind of why I had some gravel here at the shop. That way we don't really basically have to go all the way to the quarry, grab the gravel, and do all that. Alright, so I'm going to go ahead and run get the dump truck. Now the horse trailer should uh, hook onto the back of the dump truck. We're going to take the horses over to the barn and then we've got to borrow a harvester to harvest some of this stuff here. And we have to reseed it. So we are still doing a little bit of farming stuff which I tried to refrain from in this series. But I mean, it's, it's you know, it's, we have to do what we have to do. We're taking care of our land too. So I guess it's kind of AK like <laughs> landscaping or something you know so we're gonna go ahead and grab some gravel I think I'm actually let's see you know what I'm just gonna park right beside here just to make it a whole lot easier to dump it and everything so I'm gonna let that idle we haven't really drove our dump truck in a good while so I think you know it'll be Good for the old girl because we was driving the crap out of it after I like about popped the cab with it. I'm like, why ain't you driving anymore? I made it convertible. <laughs> As we tap it, there we go. It's early in the morning. I'm sorry. All right. Yo, I think it takes a couple loads to actually do this. So. Ugh. Slowly but surely. I need like a humongous bucket on this thing. We need to actually get like a uh, a little uh, inloader. We, we got a lot of stuff that we need. Like I needed the, the grass, uh, you know, a big old lawnmower now. Everything. So we need a lot of stuff, but all in due time. We got us a little mini quarry here. We don't, we don't have to, uh, uh, you know, splurge money outside. We just get everything brought here and then we can sell it. We'll trade it. There we go. And we should be okay. Let me go ahead and dump it in. I think the truck was at 93%, so I don't know if it's actually even going to take all of this. Nope, it's not. So, we'll put the rest of it back. I'll park the back here back over. We'll dump this out. I mean, it, I think it cost around like $400 for this load of gravel. It was a big dump truck full. So, I mean, it's not too bad. Now, the sand we actually added to it. But the, uh, the gravel, I think, is more than what sand is. But what I'm going to do is, eventually, I like to, you know, get more gravel. Maybe get, like, a little uh, inloader and stuff. That way we can have it here to load it. So, we, we got, like, our own little quarry and stuff here. So, we don't have to make trips up to the quarry because it does take a while. So, I'm going to tweet out to him. And we are going to be heading on out. 
I gotta say, I absolutely love this old truck. I love the color and everything. Sucker has over, uh, what, almost eight hours on it, 7.8? That's insane. Like, we use it a lot. She's a workhorse. One day I'll give it a bath. It actually rained the other day and uh, washed it all out. So, washed it. <laughs> rain, rain, go away. Is that where you, yeah, that's how you go in, but look at it. I'm glad that he has a, uh, a gate because I hate for people actually break in his house and steal his stuff. Like, <laughs> apparently this is the only farthest he went with gravel. He's like, I'm not going no other farther. All right, we'll find out where he wants. Is that him out there? I hate that. That is him out there. I don't know. I'm guessing this is where he wants his gravel pile. Yo, he has the gravel. He has a lot of the gravel. Do, 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 do. What's going on? What's going on, man? How much? Hey, where do you want this gravel at? Uh, in the big pile. This is this the big pile right here? Uh huh. All right, I got you. You can just back up close to it, and you ain't gonna get stuck or nothing. Oh, okay. Hey, I man, I got, I got, like, like, twenty-year-old dry-rotted tires on this truck. I'm good to go. How long has the dirt been on the truck? That's been on there for a while. When I first came to town, it was actually clean. <laughs> uh, Empty this out for you. See, I got you. Oh yeah, I like that truck. Yeah, I love this thing. This thing does really well. Oh yeah. I had to take this out of my secret stash. Oh, you didn't run by the quarry? Heck no, man. I got dirt, gravel, everything on hand, dude. I, I don't get to the quarry unless I have to. Heck yeah. I've been working on this road for feels like a month. Looks good. Appreciate it. Laying gravel now it does take a while. I see Man. you got the uh, railroad co uh, thing covered up. Mm-hmm. This old track. Dude, I really like this. What if the train wrecked or the bridge wrecked the train? I think. I don't know. I bet the bridge collapsed. Probably. So. I like how they didn't even get the train. Just like, just like, screw this. We're just gonna leave it here. We don't need it. Yeah, yeah. yeah. We'll just let the next owner take care of it yeah it's pretty nice here do you need a house like right over in there or something it would be pretty over cool i'll have to fill in a bunch of dirt though yeah you've been cutting some trees down on this place though have you mm-hmm got this whole track from the silo all the way down to the corner of the road and all the way to the bridge over there you've been putting in some work it looks good though Try nice and calm presentable. <laughs> yeah i got you all right, you ready to go get some horsies? Yeah, man. I'm kind of excited about that. All right. You got you getting you some? Uh, no, I got cows. Oh, I don't okay. think they mix too well. No, probably not. Now, is that your land over there? Mm -hmm. To the right? Yes. Okay, so that's all your equipment. Gotcha. Yeah, that's the cows and all that. A lot of that equipment over is rented. <laughs> Dude, I feel you. <laughs> like, that's why I had to get uh, <laughs> the horse trailer and stuff. I gotta go over to uh, uh, Nate's and rent some stuff from him. Yeah, we that's got his, a trailer uh, full of money right there. Trying to make a living off the property. Uh, I feel you. Alright, I think that's pretty good. Yeah, I was gonna bring my Ford, but I was like, well, I gotta haul some stuff, so. I'll follow you because I don't know where I'm going. Alright. How's the cows going? Man, they are doing great. Got a lot of poo. If you know anybody that needs to fertilize them, I got them. Alright. I'm no sure somebody will want it for their garden or something. Got to. 
Yeah, I made a little patch to, you know, try to get a little bit of hay and stuff off, but I don't think it's going to be too much of hay. I think it's just more or less just have something to do with the downtime. Right. this in here for the old cows or cows for the horses I ain't give myself too big of a turnaround room or anything so but we're gonna go ahead and uh, do we have a place I think we have a place around back we can actually stock them and stuff all right I'm just going to leave the truck and trailer and leave them all on the bell and stuff right now. I'll uh, dump them here later for them and stuff. But man, these horses are so pretty. I love them. I'll probably end up getting me a couple more. Maybe around like, we'll just have maybe four all together. Oh, I hear them. I hear them hollering. Oh, yeah. We got to get some, uh, you know, stuff to have some water and stuff for them like that and everything. But we'll, we'll get everything going. I'll have to look online. Hey, what are you doing? Oh, you come over here? Come on. He's like, no, I ain't coming near you. He's like, you got food? <laughs> you got an apple or sugar cube? <laughs> yeah, we'll definitely have to get them some food and stuff and place in here and get some water and stuff for them. Well, and then also, eventually, I got to get this out for it. It goes bad on me. Well, we're going to go back to the house and uh, check and see if we got any more jobs coming in because we definitely got to get some money and stuff because we are you know we've been spending money but we got to make some money so hopefully get some anyways guys if you enjoyed the series make sure you hit that like button and make sure you push that subscribe button this is ghost and i am out of here hopefully i got like a job that needs me to move a ton of gravel for like four million dollars that'd be great oh crap i left my keys down here that gone it never fails Thank you.